And all of that's gonna be equal to 52.87. So this one force is equal to all three of these forces. But which direction does this force act? Remember in our diagram, we drew it down and to the right. Okay, so that means if you pulled this way with that much force, you could actually tell these three people to go home because this one person would be doing the same thing to this box as all three of these people. I know that I have to pull down and to the right at some angle theta. Theta is equal to the inverse tangent of, of some of the forces in the y direction over some of the forces in the x direction. So remember, if I add these back to my diagram, this was the sum of the forces in the x direction, pulling it to the right, and this is the sum of the forces in the y direction, pulling it down, and so if I do the inverse tangent of this divided by this, that will give me this angle that's enclosed by this triangle. And so again, I already know these numbers. We have uh, on top, negative 51.97, that's our sum of the forces in the y direction. And then we have 9.73 in the x direction, 9.73. And so this angle theta, negative 79.4 degrees. What does it mean to have a negative angle? You have to go clockwise from the x axis. So here's our x axis. If I go 79.4 degrees clockwise and I get to that point, that is the angle at which I have to pull. 